Great morning. It is Wednesday, November 11th. So let's do uh, three cards and see what we have for the topic this morning. First card out, Tranquility. Tranquility, gravity, groundedness, and spirit is having me pull one from this deck this morning, okay. Lord only knows what we'll get from the brownies this morning. And rescue, rescue. So <clears throat> what it's saying this morning is, again, relax, tranquility, um, we know that things seem grave now, but stay grounded, you know, because rescue is on the way, okay? So, um, yeah, uh, I know it looks alarming what Trump is up to, uh, especially replacing the... Uh, the one military with this guy that's into all the conspiracy theories and everything. Yeah, the rescuing of America. America's my card for America. Okay. So um, spirit has things under control. Um, no matter how alarming this appears to be, uh, we just need to hang in there that things will rectify and, uh, you know, I, I just, you know, I have the feeling if things got too crazy, if Trump actually, and I hate to bring that into this part, this segment of the readings, but, um, you know, everything keeps pointing to, you know, that we need to just hang tough through this time. That I think that if Trump actually tried to play that card and if they didn't do Article 25, they would have a black ops thing and take him out in some some way, okay? Um, that's just my feeling. Um, <clears throat> because the uh, military, you know, when you go in, you, you promise not loyalty to a person. You promise your loyalty to the Constitution, to, you know, that's why you go in to serve in the military, to uphold freedom and everything. And when you have somebody out there that's trying to become a dictator, and Dick is right, <laughs> he's been a total dick. When you try to become a dictator, you know, they, they do have black ops. Um, and black ops are things that they're doing, militaries doing behind the scenes that nobody talks about. It's not supposed to be done. Just like Vietnam, we had uh, many that were sent behind scenes and uh, they are put there to do undercover stuff. And uh, if they get caught, the U.S. would say, we don't know anything about it. So these people are really putting their lives on the line when they do black ops um, work. Um, but the 
military is not going to let Trump take over the country and become a dictator. Somebody would take him out. Okay, somebody would take him out, physically take him out. If they don't do the 25th Amendment and he tries to put in that type of a thing, then all I can say his name, his days will be shortly numbered. Okay, um, someone will take him out. Of that, I have no, no doubt at all. Um, so, you know, not a subject I like to put out there, but um, I want people to be reassured, even though he's acting like a huge dick and dictator, <laughs> um, and doesn't matter how much he plans with Pompeo, and, you know, Lindsay and, and those ones that are uber up his butt, um, you know, uh, it's not going to happen, okay? All of their things that they're trying to take in the court are getting shot down immediately. So, you know, uh, we'll just see how much more egregious things he's going to try to do before Biden uh, steps in, okay? Um, and we should know that. He's a nasty person, okay? If he can't get what he wants, he's going to try to take everybody else down and make it as miserable as they can because he didn't get his way. This is what happens when you, you ever see spoiled rich kids. This is the way they act, okay? Everything should be given to them. They have no responsibility towards anything. And they get nasty. Okay? Nasty. <laughs> just no other way to say it. Nasty. Okay? Um, so anyway, Spirit is telling us today, stay grounded. Don't get yourself, you know, in too much of a... Um, you know, craziness that spirit is looking. Uh, they're going to rescue America. We're going to go forward. Things will be even better. No matter how much we get these uh, evangelicals, the evil angel, so-called Christians that want to, uh, you know, continue their, their nonsense. Today I got another one, and you go and you approve their message, and then they, it disappears. So I think what they're doing is they go to put their message, and then they go over, and then they block you. Okay. Well, when they block you, their message disappears. <laughs> okay. But their whole thing is Biden's evil. Biden, you know, has... Uh, late-term abortions, ripping children apart in the wombs of their mother. This is their rant. This is their rant. You know? Um, and it's not true. Biden is not for that. And all of their lies is not going to make it so. So again, you know, they are working under the auspices of the great deceiver, okay, under dark angels posing as light, turned everything 180 degrees, and uh, they're in a sad situation. So let's, uh, you know, we just keep open that they will eventually um, wake up okay uh and quit their false ideas and projecting things onto people which are not true okay um, and i think all of us know about that we've all had somebody that wants to project things on us that's not true like i said i had my little troll i don't know if they're still out there doing it but for a number of years she may be still out there. I have, I don't look. I don't look at her channel and things. But um, you 
you can't make people all happy and uh, it's not, you know, if somebody's got a problem with it, then it's their problem. Let it be their problem. You just stay in integrity, morality, you know, doing the right thing. Um, let's hope the best for the planet, not only just uh, America, but we want to come back to where we can be a leader, where America can once again be the leader that it's been. Hello, Mr. Math. Hi, Mayor Math. So we can have that leadership again for democracy. The democracy will win out and, um, and we can go forward. Isn't that right, Mr. Max? Yes. So. <laughs> oh, my big yawn. Me, big, big, big yawn. Yes. So anyway, yeah, Mr. Max is a good boy. He's uh, but I'm telling you, he's a slave driver. In the morning, he comes over and he says, you got to get up, get up out of bed. He just, he will not stop until I get up. Isn't that right, Mr. Max? Yeah. <laughs> he says, don't tell on me. Yeah, he's a good boy. He's going on the um, 19th, he's going to get his dental done. And uh, I'm worried. They said they're probably going to pull a lot of teeth. So poor Mr. Max. Coming up, but it's got to be done. Got to be done. Anyway, yeah, no, he's a good boy. He's waiting to go out for his constitutional. He likes his walk in the morning. And then every morning we come back and Mr. Max has his treasure and then he has his puppuccino. And he's liking the uh, coconut one that I got, you know, that uh, that's non-dairy. He says, those puppuccinos are just as good. Yeah, he says, I like them a lot. Yeah. <laughs> anyway. So I'm going to leave this here for the morning, but uh, yeah, just stay grounded. Don't let this stuff take you out into the ozones. Um, spirit has things under control. And yeah, the more the truth comes in, the more the darkness rails against it. So that's what's going on. Uh, Trump is going to sit there and throw his tantrum and rail and try to derail everything that he can because he's not getting his way. Um, but, uh, you know, it, it's, it, it, the government will go on when Biden gets in. They will work on uh, putting America back together again and we'll go forward and make things even better. Okay? So, Love and light to everyone. Isn't that right, Mr. Max? Yes, I know kisses. I know you love. You love. He's a lover. He says, I'm a lover, not a fighter. I'm a kisser, not a biter. Isn't that right, Mr. Max? Yeah. <laughs> Are you having trouble waking up this morning? Hmm? You having trouble waking up this morning? Yeah, well, that's what you get for waking me up early. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to leave this here. Uh, get around to doing a few other readings. Um, and we'll go from there. I'll see you online. Much love and light to everyone out there. And don't forget, mask up.